It was a legend no one who forgets. Everyone thought Koopa Fooper has left the Mushroom Kingdom. But then, the dungeons attack. Koopa Fooper is back with the biggest danger he's ever known. King Koopa. Using her ultimate superpowers, the Super Mario Brothers rescue Princess Peach and beat back the evil Koopa family. I'll get those plumbers! Ah, a lovely day cooking peach, some very fresh homemade ham che homemade pepperoni cheese toasty. Ah, this is absolutely brilliant around here. Well, a little bit of smoke, which is coming up from five minutes, but I bet that's done. Wow, Mario, is that for me? Yes, with all your favourites. Um, chorizo, jalapenos, and cheese. My favourite! Besides, you never know what comes in handy around here, darling. Yeah, I should think so as well. I wonder what the others are up to. Hmm, I'm not sure. One big fat sausages, sitting on the one that's one big fat sausages, should accidentally put in the mouth. <laughs> Sausages are mine! Ha 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 ha! Just as I suspected. Wario, you stolen one of our sausages! This was supposed to be for Mini Mario and PG Tips Monkey and the monkeys to share with them! Oh snap! I'll take this. Ugh. What's up, Mario? Caught Wario trying to steal Mini Mario's sausages. I wish Mini Mario wouldn't leave any sausages behind. Well. I should have reminded him, shouldn't I? Well, you know what he's like, shouldn't they? Um, yeah, I mean, he should never steal other people's things without asking around here. Otherwise, there's going to be a lot of trouble. And then, and then all of a sudden, oh, somebody called the police. He had to be put in prison if some people were all stolen any other personal entertainments. Well. Taking someone else's stuff that shouldn't belong to you always leads to trouble. Ask Fire Mario. He's the only one who, try who knows any single sense around this insane asylum. After all that time, your belly has been chubby and never and things like that, and you're not going to like it. But I'm putting you on a straight diet, and that's final. Ah, nuts. <laughs> what a lovely day to be at the walk, you guys. Yeah, it is uh, absolutely brilliant. Who would have thought inviting so many people when we got us, Monkey? Yeah, of course. Hey look, there's Donkey Kong and the monkeys are just sitting on a bench. Let's go meet them. It's your turn, Crash. Your turn to play our spy. Okay, um, I spy with my little eye. Something beginning with <gasps> Mini Mario. Mini Mario is not a letter, is it? Hi up, guys. Hey, Mini Mario, what are you doing here? We just had a little bit of a walk. Care to join us? Oh, don't mind if I do. Crash, do you want to come with us? Yep, of course. Monkeys? Yep, we will. Alright then, all hands on deck. Safety's first around here. I need to give you a little bit of a safety buzz around here because you need to be careful while you're walking. Otherwise, it will trip over and then crack your neck. Yeah, I will, will be very careful around the rocks. Right. I've got to get to the bottom of this without washing up and putting the pots away around here. I'll get Peach to do the washing up. Right, let's see what else he's up to. Are you trying to say that Donkey Kong is going out for a jungle date? Not necessarily. You see, Donkey Kong is on for a big adventure walk to find his very own place, his old place that he remembers from many years ago. I know Crash took the shortcut and anything like that because you used to go out with Donkey Kong to the jungle date around here. Well, not a jungle date. Um, well, to find to find any criminals and things like that, including some of the other thieves and anything like that, that that people steal and anything. Looks like Donkey Kong is on another jungle adventure with the monkeys. Well, yes. And plus, Mini Mario, Peach Tips Monkey and Crash is coming along with them. And basically, they're on a big... Big walk around here. I had to be aware of tractors. Literally, you two. Me and Fire Mario didn't even go trespassing on someone else's farm, but there is a secret field that is coming up 
near the traffic lights around here. I'll show you another time when you come. But what about that den where Badger used to live? He still lives there, but we haven't seen him for a very while, not since 2001. Well, well, if it isn't those little old childhood friends that I haven't seen for a lifetime. Ah, nuts. Hello, you two. Long time no see. It's a pleasure to see you at your new home. Basically, me and my son saw a fairy one tiny Mario walking past our den. Is that one of your relatives or something? Tiny Mario? Hmm? Oh, that's Mini Mario. Sorry, um, Mini Mario decided to go on a walk with Monkey and, um, Donkey Kong and the Monkeys and Crash are sat on a bench waiting for him. Oh, now that's a masterpiece around here. It's healthy to go around walking. It's just that to get a breath of fresh air, that's all. Just for one thing. If there's anything in here that you need to be careful of. Well, just one thing. You see, you have to be careful on any single reptile. His name's King Cooper and uh, he causes trouble by kidnapping people and things like that. He might kidnap you. They will know because uh, we'll, we'll see it at the news and things like that. Snoopy has a news report job. That's where we saw. We came to the men's working club for breakfast and watched the breakfast news at the same time. Mario, I'm not sure if there's any single person who works there involving badgers in a pub. Well, basically, they normally come into that pub around here for breakfast. That's why. Ah, here we are, guys. The jungle. Well, more like a hundred acre wood, but I call it the jungle because it's more like trees and things like that. What do you guys think? I think this jungle turns out to be much more smarter than anyone else. I hope that Cortex isn't around. I'm going to have to search over there. Oh, Cortex, where are you? Oh, I think somebody went past. That wasn't Cortex around here. That was them two cheeky monkeys. We'll just have a little bit of a warm round of jungle. This is our jungle and it looks like we're in South Africa. Well, turns out it isn't around here, so we're not in South Africa around here. We're in the site of Elvis Town Woods. And why is that? Have you spotted a shortcut? Me and Mini Mario has spotted every single shortcut around here and that failed because um, people thinking they're cheating. Shall we take the shortcuts just in case? I reckon so. Come on. <laughs> ah, isn't this nice sun? Sitting down there at the MTFSS residence without any hassle. Sure is, Dad. Maybe we should never go back home down to your den. Well, we have to go back there, otherwise there'll be an R.I.P. And uh, people might repossess our den. Am I the only one who actually fell in love with a single badger? A single father to the son of law? Oh, and uh, who might be you? Why, I'm a normal cat. Normal cat? Like... Everybody calls me Finn. Uh, pardon me, little Miss Loveliness around here, but isn't there a tail behind you? Me? A tail? I haven't seen that before in my life. You see, here I am in the MTFSS residence looking for a badge of love and anything I don't, and now you're chasing me I having a tail? Uh-oh. What, what the? Ow. Please forgive my son for being so rude. Perhaps you might want to go and make some snack. You know, Mr. Badger of Arthur of yours, you're the so handsome prince that ever we wanted in the whole wide world. You've been single for a while and you've been divorced by the older wife just because um, she's into someone else around here. She's been cheating on anyone else. Oh yeah. Speaking of which, right, you got to tell Mario that you've been cheating, that um, she's been cheating on you for someone else. Your son is right. Here you go, love. Oh, and um, after we eaten, I thought I might take you to this wonderful castle, where it is safe, in case there's any bugs around. Isn't she wonderful, son? 
Isn't she absolutely wonderful? Okay, funny. This is much more like a very good castle, is it? Um, are you trying to tell me to take into the magical castle around here with a girl that doesn't even match the tail? Nonsense! But it does actually match the rest of me! Cooper! What turn me to the International King Cooper? Zap! <laughs> what? Uh, you mean... I felt for King Cooper? Yeah! Looks like you badgers have been tricked! <laughs> What is up guys, Snoopy here and here's your today's headlines. Those two nostalgic badgers have been kidnapped by King Cooper. Badgers was flirting with that kitty right down there and um, he think he was a real kitty, but it's not. Cooper Rupert has matched King Cooper into that girl thinking, thinking that it was a great idea to fool the badgers. Well for the rest of the headlines in around a half an hour. Not again! Why would he ever have King Cooper on his side? I mean, King Cooper is always trying to steal everybody, not whatsoever. I know, but, um, I just had an idea for you. I think it's about time that King Cooper had the dream love. Wait, dream love? I'm going to go and get Rosalina. I'm right here, Mario. Good, um, I want you to transform Narky into a very pretty monkey. What the? But Mario, what am I supposed to do? Well, why don't you just go and surprise Coop Fruper for a little bit? Okay, dokie. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Oh. How are you, my darling? My mate called me Jessica Monkey, but you can call me. Sweet lips! Wow, my darling, you got some kisser. Yeah, who is his actual girlfriend around here? Is he your crush around here? Oh, um, oh, um, can you do a little bit, of a bit more privacy around here? Why don't we see if we could go down in some sort of bathtub around here? You get out of here and leave us in peace! Finally! I'm here to rescue you, mate. Cheers, Narky. I'm not sure Bowser will like this. Well, Bowser only wants me to be happy. Hmm. <laughs> uh, ah. And believe me, Bowser, Jessica is only one gorgeous monkey for me. <laughs> Narky! Narky? Ah! I've been kissed by an odd fuck! Na 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 na! I'm gonna tie your lips be round your neck! And you'll never kiss again! Okay, Pikachu, you're all set. When Narky comes in, I'll tell you to use the Wonderbolt. Ha! 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 Cooper is. He's right behind me and King Cooper is. Uh, Narky, this way! Uh, uh, Pikachu, now! Pikachu! What the? Uh, 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 Aha! Told you we'd find a shortcut. Now, all I need to do is to exit. But Crush, don't you think this is absolutely dangerous to exit that way? Nonsense. Let's go. Oh, oh. They are, you see. All I can see is plain paths and a bridge. Haha, <laughs> perfect hiding spots under this bridge around here. Donkey Kong won't find us now. Ha 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 ha. Hey, you lot, what are you doing down there? There's no time to be up there. It's dangerous. Well done, Noki. That was good thinking. And that was good thinking, Rosalina. Now, that was very helpful, my darling. Yeah, Mr. Harris, I just um, disguised Noki as a um, very lovable monkey as a girl. <coughs> oh, um, that's a phone ringing. Must be Mini Mario. Hello, on your, on, your, on your way back around here? 
Nice try, Mario, but it's Donkey Kong. Oh, hey, Donkey Kong, how's it going? Um, the walk is getting all right around here, just to let you know that we are on our way back, so... We must surprise them with, the, with any other surprises. Oh, I've already got a surprise. We've got the badges. Oh, brilliant! I can't wait to get home then. So, um, I shall see you guys when we get home. Yeah. See you then. See ya. Pop pop. Mini Mario and the monkeys are coming home right now around here, so you better surprise them. That sounds like a jolly idea. A jolly idea for two badgers. Hey up, Uncle Badger! I heard you brought your son around to the MTFSS residence. Hey up, Sue, what are you doing in here? I just came to pop in and see what you guys are up to. Wait, it's Mr. Badger, your uncle. Of course! Me and Sooty usually pop into his den to see them. Yeah, um, oh, you, in case you haven't noticed, Sue and Sooty have popped into our place and, um, have a nice cup of coffee and things like that. Impossible! You're badgers! You don't have electricity in your den! We didn't back then until somebody invented us electricity, plug sockets, and any other TV aerials on RF cables. Yeah, that was me. <laughs> Why didn't you tell us, Pikachu? We could have just be our heroes and invented our electricity for them lot. I'll try them my best around here. I'm the electrician. And um, basically, it, the electrician always does the job. Especially me, Bulbasaur, and Charizard. Next time, phone Bob the Builder and see if he can fix it. I'll try. Yoo-hoo! We're back! Me and my good old pals had a fantastic walk in the woods around here, and um, Crash showed me a very secret exit. And I thought I was cheating, but it's not. But... Where's Monkey? Oh, um, he has a temporary shift at McDonald's, so he, um, he, he wanted to go straight on the bus around here and catch up with his work. Well, good luck for Mr. Monkey around here. Yeah, good luck for Monkey. I hope you save some for me. Since you're all here, how about we throw ourselves a party straight away? Throw yourself a party straight away? But, um, I need Calmo Bunny first to throw yourself a party. And I need to get a bunch of girls for the to dance with around here. I got to get my good old pal and my girlfriend actually around here. And Nora and we are going to go and grab a fantastic flamingo and a purple duck or something. How about that? Well, basically that purple duck, or what you're talking about, is a platypus. Perry the platypus. No, it's not Perry the platypus, it's just a purple platypus. Oh. I'm going to go and get Peach around here, and me and Peach decided to do a bit of a dancing routine. What dancing routine are you going to do? Well, me and Peach are about to do, um, dirty dancing around here. Dirty dancing. Ah, uh, you see, um, I was watching that sort of dancing on My Spy Family. Wait, you have a programme? <laughs>